In this video, we're going to be looking at multiplication in the form of an array. An array is grouped into columns and rows. Now, each row has a certain amount in it. So to find the first factor, we're going to look at how many total rows we have. In this one, I have one, two, three, four rows, and there are one, two, three things in each row. Now I have my expression of four times three. We can solve to find out what four times three is by counting everything in the array. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12. Now, there is something called the commutative property of multiplication, which is just like the commutative property of addition. That means you can switch the factors and end up with the same product. This array has the same amount as this one. It's just tipped differently. If this one is four by three, this one is one, two, three by one, two, three, four. You can see they both have 12 in them. They just have it arranged differently. Instead of four rows, there are three rows. There are three things in these rows, but four in those. Three times four is still 12. 